Let me show you an easy way how to combine two normal maps together in order to achieve some cool effects. So for example, we have this plane covered with the snow and as you can see, this is just a simple plane without subdivisions or anything, just one face and all these snow details are fake details or free details coming from a normal map. If I disable normal map, we don't have details enable it, we have all details. I say free details because this is really easy to render and we don't have a displacement, we don't have a bunch of loop cuts here and uh, faces that will make our render slower. So this is really simple and fast to render. Okay, so now in order to achieve some cool effects like to add some footprints here in the snow, we need to combine two normal maps together. So this is a snow material and if I add a normal map here with footprints so let me show you these are footprints right and this is how this normal map looks from the snow we can easily combine these together to have both worlds in one face right here so let me show to make your life easier go and enable node wrangler in blender just check this option and go here and save preferences and leave it like that because now with the node wrangler enable we can go and press Control shift and right click and combine these two together like this really simple and easy and we have this so if you go with the zero we have first effect if you go with the one we have these snow footprints but if you want both worlds together i just go with the one and then instead of mix i go to overlay and this is really fast and easy way to combine these two normal maps together practically with just one drag and one click here okay this is cool way this is okay and i use it most of the time but if you want more accurate mathematically accurate way then we should use something like this uh, combine normals right this node right here this node looks something like this right and uh, let me show you if you want to take a screenshot to make it on your own but i will give you this for free it will be on my patreon the link is down there in the description but it's completely free everyone can download it so basically what this does is make this effect a little bit more mathematically correct so what you need to do is just go with one normal map go with another normal map and then go this and place into a normal so it's basically looks the same almost the same but if you zoom it in and just go between these two you can see there are more details and calculations are, are a little bit more accurate so this is how it looks this is the first way this is the second way and in some cases this really shines over the first way but in some cases you can just use the first way and also here you have the benefit to let me show to lower the strength of each of these normal maps like that so you can have more control over it and this is the, this is really simple and easy way to combine two normal maps i used this method in my previous video to combine two normal maps together one is to form the details on this rock that i sculpt and another one to add the material of the grass and these rocks right there so basically this is the first way just to combine two normal maps with a mixed color node and this is the second way and check out the difference before and after so first way second way first way second way you can see the second way has even more details small details better projection better calculations but if you want to look it from really far away and these are not too drastical changes you can see right here first and second first and second if you go and render view first and second ah, you can see here the second method is a little bit better yeah but that's it so if you find this video helpful press that like button and also if you want to learn how i made this rock and the whole environment nature environment that comes with it check out this video right here see you there bye bye